Kerala continues to battle heavy rains and landslides. The death toll in the state has reached 42 and over 1 lakh people have been removed to relief camps. Flood situation in Karnataka also remains grim and so far more than 24 people have died in the rain related incidents and all over Konkon railway trains have been cancelled due to landslide near Karwar. Indian Meteorological Department issues red alert for 8 districts and orange alert for 6 districts of the state for today. Red alert has been issued for 3 districts and orange alert for 6 districts for the state for tomorrow. As per our sources, in nearly 950 relief camps across the state, more than 1 lakh people have been shifted. In the worst affected Vanayad, more than 25,000 people are in such camps. Many people are still feared trapped on the debris following major landslides that hit the Vanayad and Malapuram district. Rescue operations have restarted from today early morning. I am quite concerned about uh, the heavy rainfall, uh, the landslide that is taking place in my constituency. I have spoken to three collectors over there. Uh, they've uh, briefed me on the situation. I've also called uh, the Chief Minister of Kerala. Uh, we had a conversation and I requested him to help as much and as fast as possible. I'm going to call the Prime Minister uh, and mention to him also that YNR is, uh, sorry, my constituency is in need of assistance. Uh, I was planning to go there but the collector told me that that would not be a good idea because it would disturb rescue operations and I'm going to go there as soon as possible. I just want the people of Vyanar uh, to know that I'm standing with them and I will be with them as soon as possible. We are going to help out as much as we can. I've also told the workers of the Congress party to be there with the people uh, and help in this difficult time. Meanwhile, rail and air services were hit in Kerala as Kochi airport has to be shut due to water logging and over 20 trains were cancelled by Southern Railway. Educational institutions remain shut. Bureau report, Konar Clive.